six years ago I lost my leg, my job, my life, but last year when my claim was settled I started to get my life back on track. The hospital failed to diagnose that it was a popliteal aneurysm and as a consequence of their failure to deal with it I lost my leg. This is the leg they gave me. That, I had to do that to stop that one going. Most of the time uh, when I came home from hospital I spent it on my own. My, my partner worked full time and as a consequence I became very lonely, very distant from people. I found difficulty in moving around the house. I went back to work and tried to get back to some form of normality but that, that didn't work. It wasn't a good time for me. I had to stop sort of doing the things I normally do, going to the races, going to the allotment, going to the pub and mixing with my friends. I became very lonely at home. I know this sounds funny but it, um, I couldn't get my life back together. Um, I needed help to do that. I needed physio. I definitely needed a better leg to help with my mobility. It was then that somebody recommended Boyce Turner as a company that could deal with medical negligence claims regarding amputations. They were right on the case, they got in touch with the hospital, they got all the notes, they found out that in fact my amputation could have been avoided if the correct procedures had been taken. They put together a really good team of professionals, all of them were very good and very supportive. Even though the hospital denied they're at fault, my solicitors negotiated a settlement for me. This enabled me to turn my life around. I was able to purchase a prosthetic leg from the London Prosthetic Clinic and they've been extremely supportive. If I have any problems with the leg, I can phone them at any time and I can go down and have it looked at any time I want to. What it's done for me is that I've been able to now walk properly first for the first time in five years. I can move around the house, I move with confidence, I can go upstairs with confidence, I can now go into the kitchen and cook my own food, make cups of tea, not worrying when I go near a, a stove that I'm going to sort of knock something over. What this will enable me to do is to convert the house so that it'll have a wet room, a through the floor lift and it will enable Leslie and I to live in the house that we've lived in for the last 22 years. I'm letting go of the resentments towards the hospital. I'm looking forward to my future. I'm excited to be walking down the aisle later this year to marry my partner. I feel confident enough to go abroad on our honeymoon. Without that compensation and without the input of Boyce Turner, that would not be possible.